I say to, uh, to my honourable friend that I know, and he has uh, continued to champion the uh, concept of leaving without a deal with the European Union. I believe it is important for this country that we're able to leave in an orderly way. Uh, he references WTO terms. Of course, we, tr we trade with many countries across the world, not on WTO terms, but on the terms that are determined by the EU trade agreements with those, with those countries. Um, what I, but actually, leaving without a deal is not just about our trade arrangements. It is about other issues. It is about our security as a country as well. There are other matters that uh, a deal will cover. I continue to believe that leaving with a deal in an orderly way is in the best interests of this country, and that's what I'm pursuing. In the midst of these important and inevitably contentious exchanges, can I ask the House to join me in warmly welcoming in the gallery today former Speaker of the New Zealand Parliament, David Carter, accompanied by Deputy Speaker of the Parliament, the Honourable Anne Tolley MP. It's a, a great delight to welcome you both. You come from a country that we regard as a great friend, and David, you've been a great friend to us and to me. Welcome.